Welcome back to the channel, my name's Jamison, and in this video I'm going to cover how to find the seaweed collector and thus finish the finding the seaweed collector mission issued by Mima the sea person in Day of the Diver. Let's get on with the guide. Alright to find it we're going to start off outside Mima's shop and slowly make our way to the main gate, exit the main gate and start swimming. Once you're through the main gate, start heading towards the exit, into the depths of the blue hole, like so. And then from here, you're going to want to slowly begin to ascend and make your way through the narrow gaps. And your end destination will be the Whalebone Graveyard, just up ahead. It is a bit of a hike, so catch some fish while you're there and make sure you don't get eaten. I just keep following this path here, it is the quickest. Once you're through the opening and into the whalebone graveyard, avoid the spider crabs and the mega mouth shark that usually spawns here, and make your way to the far left of the trench, and slowly creep your way up until you start seeing these plastic bag looking things which are actually jellyfish. Mm -hmm. It will trigger Dave to speak and say follow it. From here, you're going to want to loot any of the item crates you can find and hopefully get your hands on a torch. It's usually the first crate you find down here that will be a torch, if not it's the second. So grab a torch, you can get around the weeds. You could do a long way around to avoid going through them, but no point in doing that. But just use your torch and make your way down through the tunnel, following the jellyfish fragments. Remember, if you touch these things, you will lose oxygen. But it's a relatively simple, straightforward path. If you don't get sidetracked, like most people do in this game, and do 50 other things at once, and forget you were here, because that happened in my first playthrough. Just keep following the bags. It is a bit of a journey. But once you reach this underwater house, you'll know you're there. And from here, you're gonna go inside, you'll see the seaweed collector, He'll ask you to help out with this turtle, like so. But that's about it. That's how you find the seaweed collector, guys. And that's all there is to it. So I hope you found this guide helpful. If you did, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel for more great gaming guides. Thanks for watching and happy diving. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye for now.